is good evening ma'am and good evening sir and good evening everyone and it was a nice session in hambela about uh, digital smart working switch uh, on your video otherwise 50% points only you will get oh my god it's mandatory ma'am is it mandatory <laughs> 50% you will get you otherwise if 50% you will not get no problem if you are 50% go to robot now artificial <laughs> intelligence is making the voice so we can yes. give the 50% to the system oh my yes. goodness we, we, we don't know whether khadija is okay. speaking or khadija's no. robot is speaking no problem go ahead speak okay okay actually uh, i have some doubts uh so i was showing us uh, one slide uh, there was a how to handle switch pci communication i think so uh, uh, kind of things uh, written over there so i couldn't recall properly so how even i have a query that how could we tackle such situations if i come across Doctor Ram, could you understand the question? Uh, there are some voice breaking. Can you repeat? Um... Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, sure. So, as uh, one thing is there uh, in your slide, uh, how you have to manage, you have to tackle the uh, criticism means uh, in such a way that uh, others won't feel bad. So, uh, please give some examples. Uh, um, means any kind of example so you have uh, means you ha handled in a very um, what effective manner so please give one example it would be good for us yeah always the people getting the criticism when they are doing something at home or any workplace or the city they are evolving every person or personalities are getting the comments Uh, from the surrounding people, whether they are doing good, whether they are not meeting out with the good things, so there are always the critical comments coming. When you are having your colleague every day, you are wearing some dress, eating something, or doing some kind of ritual kind of thing. So the, there are something opinion um, making the conflicts are different, but there are people who can able to tolerate the capacity or making them to understand. Uh, i can say uh, certain ways in singapore it is giving the opportunity for any race any religion or any nationality to come and live in singapore but they are having their guidelines compliance regulation how to make the harmony to be better so you have to arrange such certain kind of way the school also having this kind of thing because they are getting different kind of people to come and study in that market there are some parents they may be uh, making things the critic comments about the school how it is treating the students are they engaging in some kind of activities so there are something you have to make yourself how the law or compliance fit into the environment or making them to understand why you formulating all these rules why you wanted to instruct the people to keep in mind to cooperate to follow the rules so there are criticisms always coming but how do you handle the criticism that is very important your attitude your mindset your maturity or your experience or you need some support from the lead side or from the government side or any kind of superior officers in inside your organization so these are all the way you have to improve i have also faced this kind of uh, things in different kind of situation but it is a person and personality a big role for that how do i cope up with the critical comments how do i make myself to fit into the environment doing the right thing and coming over from that particular challenge so everywhere it is quite common even a child having the critical comments from the parents how do they able to achieve the better thing because always parents are they're telling something because they want to improve the performance value for the children whether they are waking in the early morning doing the homework in correct time making the eating behavior very perfectly or wearing that kind of dress and they come back from the school without any kind of dirty or something uh, 
Um, okay, Khadija, I hope that you got your um, answers. There are many hands raised. You should always remember one thing, Khadija, that Khuda hamko aisi khudai na de ki mere seva kuch dikhai na de. So you should always keep in mind that only God is perfect. Okay, and whatever we are doing, whatever we are, whatever position we have achieved, so there are flaws in that, there are shortcomings, there are limitations. So if somebody criticizes, we have to take it in a positive way. That, okay, if it is there in me, I have to correct it. If it is not there in me, then I have to just move on. So it in this way, the, the life becomes very easy. And the people who are focused towards their goals, they hardly bother about the criticism. The people, those who don't have any goal, they only think about why he has said that, why she has said that, why it has happened. Why... So I think taking criticism in a positive way is a very, very uh, demand skill. No, actually, okay. okay. Khadija, I think as Seba has also raised the hand. We have to give one, one minute time to everyone. Then you have to share uh, your okay. links also. So we will chat separately, Khadija. Separately, we can chat. Okay. Seba, please go ahead. Today's uh, class one is very good, Masala. I have prepared all the you know, what, uh, teammates, Alhamdulillah. And uh, I have shared all, also the link to our uh, teammates individually, Alhamdulillah. Okay, Khadija. Thank you very much. Well done. Zeba, over to you. Uh, Zeba, we are not able to listen to you. Uh, there is some audio issue. Now is it okay? Yes, it's okay now. Okay. So, Asalaamu Alaikum and good Alaykum. evening. Uh, about the uh, lecture today, actually it was uh, something, I feel like this is this session for me because I really want to learn digital things more. And I think that uh, to progress and handling the uh, Generation Z, it's uh, very important. And I really want to get cooperation and collaboration with someone who can um, some organization or people who can actually uh, help me to develop because so many things in mind but i want to bring it together and want to be more efficient on that area one thing and uh, I, I do agree with ramsar that what he said about like for making it contextual and for our uh, collaboration with uh, the community, all those things is possible if we can understand the uh, smart leadership with uh, the background of uh, uh, new era. And uh, as a teacher also, and as a humanitarian worker, I feel like the transformation from cognitive to uh emotional or behavioral it's uh um depend on our uh it should start from us and then we should we should know how to do the collaboration and uh showing the uh, reliance but for that i think we need more intensive uh sessions actually because i, I feel like we got a flashlight and we are very yes, much yes. Seba, actually dr ram has uh, three more sessions so inshallah he will be you must have seen his module because there are uh, four more four uh, sessions in his module so he is going to explain and uh, since you know we have to keep the time in the mind so keeping the time in mind what we are going to do is that these two hands are raised we will give them one one minute time for the questioning and then after that for sharing session i will send you all in the breakout room one room will be handled by ram one room by rihana and one room by me and three of us will listen to you uh, your you. sharing session in this way we will finish the session on time so shabana over to you please one minute time to you shabana kosar yeah good evening all uh, thank you so much, Dr. Ram, for a wonderful session. So today I learned uh, the smart leadership. That's very, very important. The first thing I learned was improve your knowledge. That's a really important thing we need to learn. Like we have joined this course, one month leadership course. We are learning so many things. As we think we experience one, but we daily as a smart leader, it's our duty to learn something new. Like uh, we have the digital uh, uh, leadership. It's also very important. Still, we can see teachers, they won't come up or people, they'll not come up to learn technology. 
and everything is based on technology we are duty to learn all these things being a leader we should uh, learn something and make a uh, like colleagues or team members to make them learn all these things is very important and delegation of work this is also very important like sometimes we see we take a, take everything on our shoulder uh, so every one person cannot do all the things all the time it is our duty to delegate our work so that we can create more leaders that is also very very important so thank that also you have learned regarding system leadership like a uh, system insight collaborative skills and uh, uh, leadership adequate tactics is also very important i uh, really i have learned first time so inshallah i'll be working on that thank you thank you shabana thank you very much now one minute to you fatima fatima khan one minute to you yes assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh a very good work. good evening to one and all present here thank you ma'am for giving the opportunity it was really a tremendous session uh, it was a uh, quite uh, mind boggling like uh, we are uh, living in the digital era and we have to cope up with the uh, uh, technically smart and i really like uh, the all the uh, presentation what sir had told and <clears throat> it will be great um, if the ppt is shared uh, you know so that uh, we can um, go back and reflect on it and uh, we can make some moves and uh, i really liked about like the goals have to be smart uh, as uh, like in a broader depth uh, when we see it has to be uh, really attainable like there are some instances like we uh, make some goals which are not uh, achievable so it has to be time based and it has to be relevant so thank you so for um making us uh, explain in such a way uh, that is very lucid and concise yet precise thank you thank you very much fatma now we all have to go to the breakout room and for the breakout room the mentors uh, dr ram and rihana mm -hmm. what we have to do is we have to give them one one minute time to share so that you can uh, give us the report that everybody has shared for one minute and the sharing will be about today's learning today's learning from starting from uh, the app slack uh, and then uh, the session what they have learned and how digitally empowerment is important to be the smart leader so you have to give them one one minute time so that they can share this is a part of their assignment so now ladies and gentlemen you all know that how we are going to be in the breakout room for that we all have to unmute and say loudly khulja sim sim Oh, yeah. It is not loud enough. It is not opening. It is not listening even. You have to say loud. Kulja, Kulja, Sim, Kulja, Sim, Sim. It is saying that uh, Modinat has to say. Then only it will open. Modinat. Kulja, Sim, Sim. Yeah, <laughs> yes, <Abhi. laughs> so on your screen there is a message join the room please go and join the room okay dear ram you also have to join one room you are also assigned a room Okay, so now those who are here, take one minute time and start sharing. Yes, Sana, start. Good evening, ma'am, and assalamu alaikum. Uh, today, um, uh, the task was to uh, make a group uh, on uh, Slack, uh, the new uh, electronic platform. Uh, and I learned that uh, this is completely new uh, for me. I never heard about this uh, app. When I was uh, uh, when I was downloading and making the team, I was qu quite excited, and I felt that uh, today I am going to learn something new. And uh, now I am I feel that I am very empowered, and uh, I can uh, I can handle this uh, Slack uh, app for my uh, future uh, convenience and for the future uh, experience. And after attending uh, Dr. Ram's session, I felt that I need more time to understand or elaborate the topic as we are living in, in, in an electronic age. And this is the uh, electronic era. There, there is a revolution 
uh, electronic revolution and the apps like chat gp as uh, i've been using this chat gp since three months and i found that this is completely uh, completely a change era where we have to uh, prepare our mind to learn about something and simply we go to uh, that app and we we, we will uh, able to complete the task but for that we have also some kind of experience we have to learn first we have to read research and after completing uh, work on that type of applications like chat gpt after completing the task we have to go through the complete uh, complete uh, uh, method complete content that we have received correct things or not so as we are living completely electronic and uh, in uh, electronic intelligent era there is everything is computer based now so as a leader uh, one of our uh, participants said as a leader we have to learn all these things first and then we have we can apply to our team members thank you ma'am thank you so much these are my opinion these are my learning from today's session and uh, today's task thank you so much very good now shabana over to you these are my opinion yeah. uh, thank you so much uh, today's learning was uh, to make an app of slack it was new for me i don't know what is slack for morning when i was going through the challenge i said what is slack then uh, dr zeva shares and link to me then again i thought and i downloaded it and i came to know what is new slack till now you were knowing about only like whatsapp or snapchat or instagram all this thing but these thing we were not knowing so we came to know about slack so this is something new app they really to help us make notes all this thing and to communicate so being a leader it's my duty to train my teachers also what is slack so easy for me uh, to see notes everything now second thing what i learned is regarding leadership uh, being a leader it is my duty to adapt new uh, change in me and try to learn something and regarding communication communication is very important like where i am communicating to with whom i am talking where i am talking what i am doing like suddenly what happened being leader we are very rude we don't know what is going inside our police and our team members our teachers all this thing so we should know why we are talking whom we are talking at what time we are talking was the point of talk that is also very very important you must be good in english that is different thing but the place where you are talking to whom you are talking and what affects uh, it being our communication to other member that is also very very important the next thing is smart leadership that is really important with the community with the individual and with the system we need to deal all these things stakeholders and we to learn the skills learning skills is very important for us to become a smart leader and empowerment of digital era this is digital era it has duty to empower ourselves learn new techniques daily and try to adapt ourselves so that inshallah we can be a good great leaders in future and we can be with others in future so thank you so much thank you thank you shabana and now ruhi over to you please you go ahead ruhi are you there ruhi from katak Mm, I think Ruhi has some issues. That's why she is not able to uh, contribute. So anyway, actually, Slack is uh, a new platform even for me. Yesterday, what happened when I was uh, thinking and I was uh, doing research that which type of uh, activity has to be conducted uh, and which type of challenge has to be given for a smart leadership. Uh, although I received two questions from Dr. Ram, that was like. all academic question that find out the qualities of a smart leader and this type but i wanted to have some practical thing then i have gone through so many uh, sites and so many apps and so many softwares and then i have see i found that slack is something that is very easy also and a new also because i also didn't he hear about slack before then immediately i just uh, I logged in and I have signed up and then I have invited you people and then I created one group on that for Edufam and then the same task I have given to you all is still even I have to learn uh, about that even more and I have to explore about that even more more we explore more we will find that it is going to be helpful for us and as a smart leader naturally we have to find all the ways whatever we can do so that we can empower ourselves with this uh, digital literacy. 
digitally, if you are empowered, we find that there are many, many app, uh, softwares, applications available that can they can make our task very easy. So that's why it is important that a smart leader has to be digitally empowered leader. I think now we have to uh, uh, call them also. We have to call them into the main room. I will close all the rooms. Let them come in the main room now. Okay, so now they will be joining us within a few seconds. Ruhi, if you want to share, you can share now. Are you in the position of sharing? Ruhi is just saaf chupte bhi nahi, saamne aate bhi nahi. Khoop parda hai ki chilban se lage baithe hain, wohi Ruhi ka ho raha hai. Na to aahi rahi hai, na jaahi rahi hai. Yes, Engineer Khadija. How are you? Where are our other people? Everybody got the chance to share or no? Yes. yes. I, 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 I can't. I was going to. Oh, oh you didn't get the chance? No. <laughs> but, but you already got the chance to share. So you don't no, want... I really want to ask Ramsar one question. Uh, yes, Dr. Ram, are you there? Yeah, yes, Zeba, go ahead, ask one question. So I am asking that uh, uh, that Slack, which one we are using today, we used, that one can be used for research purpose, like uh, totally, uh, I'm having a research work, ongoing research work, and if I use it, and um, uh, how much it will be um, uh, like, uh, ethical uh, to use uh, Slack in uh, for uh, like a research platform uh, to sharing the files and all those things. I really want to know like digital, uh, digital things and ethics, how it go uh, side by side. That was my question. Yes. Yeah, there are many ways, uh, but we should not affect the time for other people. Uh, Dr. Ram will reply to this question tomorrow. Yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. Okay, I will, or I will maybe Sam, you can give in the uh, chat box. But all, all, all these tools created only for research purpose. Then only it is happening to come into the application oriented. Because first trying for research oriented kind of activities, how to engage. You can see the PubMed for getting the abstracts or review articles or research articles. Now the chat GPT is going to do the same thing. True. So it was earlier when 20 years back itself, we could be able to search for getting the research paper for our keywords to uh, get some idea for our consecutive research plan. So now it is getting transformed into the level of chat GPT. So yes. these things are yes. happening. So we will talk in separate manner how to understand your tasks or your challenges to support from digital tools or connecting platform. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Okay, so thank you very much, everyone. It was a very interactive session. I hope you all got the chance to share or is there anyone who didn't get the chance to share? Ma'am, I was about to tell, but I strolled only for 50 seconds, but I have uh, explained everything. In the breakout room, it, um, my, when my turn came, it showed that uh, it will finish in the class okay. will end. Actually, Rihanna, Rihanna, I spoke. I spoke. Uh, fine, fine. Rihanna, you have to train one of the participants to have the red card in the hand. That is very important to follow the timing so that our timing is very limited. Basically, it is meant for 45 minutes. Out of that, 25 minutes for the participation and uh, participants and 20 minutes for the speaker. In this way, it is divided. So anyway, it is a very helpful because we all we are the ladies and enthousi enthusiastic ladies. We want to learn more and more, but I know the family members are eagerly waiting for you and I don't want to uh, disturb your family. So that's why. Good night, everyone. See you tomorrow. Take care. Thank you. 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 Thank
Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, Ram sir. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Yeah. Thank you, Ram sir. Thank, Thank you for the wonderful session. Thank you.